They are part of the landscape of every city. These utility boxes that store everything from electric to water to traffic control components. They are at the very least boring, if not downright unattractive. But the city of Las Vegas is filled with talented artists who leave their mark in so many examples of public art. So why not ask them to turn boring boxes into something like this? The AMP Utility Cabinet Painting Program was established in 2017, and to keep it going, the City of Las Vegas, the Las Vegas Arts Commission, the Water District, and NV Energy recently set out to get more boxes painted. In general, the city is sponsoring art projects. It shows they care about more than just, you know, getting bodies through the door. Yeah, it, it's, a, it's a great thing. Jerry Misco is one of 25 local artists commissioned by the city to spruce up the boxes. He's out in front of the plaza on Main Street. He's carrying out the theme of the bright lights of Vegas. Uh, main kind of practice is abstracting from old school Vegas neon and lights. And the imagery is actually taken from the Porta Cachere um, uh, underneath the, the plaza valet over there. And I abstract from those amazing bulbs and um, try <laughs> my very best to create this feeling of of buzz, of energy, of movement, of like of what they call chasing lights. He's no stranger to large scale public art, so this utility box is actually less challenging and more exciting for him. But when I do murals, I've done you know five stories inside of a building. So this is kind of a medium scale, I kind of guess. But the bigger I go, the more I like to kind of zoom in, <laughs> you know, and, and just feel these, like, like you're up in the sign yourself. Just a little north of this creation, you'll find another artist, Darbiana, working her magic on this amp box near the Neon Museum and Cashman Center. So this creation is called Inside and Out. Um, it's the black women are gonna have uh, roses coming out of their chest or their head. Um, it's just basically showing like that they're beautiful inside and out. This is the first time she has painted a utility box, but she sees it as a great opportunity to not only brighten the area of this city, but to send a positive message to women of color. I wanted to see um, more representation of um, like the women in my life. And so it, it just inspired me to want to put them in the community so that when uh, the other women around here see it, that they could feel like uh, more positive and like encouraged to, to be confident in themselves. Most of the artists who pride themselves in creating public art say projects like this program bring art to everyone, even those who've never had the chance to step foot into a museum or gallery. I'm here to spread some joy, some love, um, beautify the community, uh, hopefully bring more positive vibe to the area. If you're lucky enough to catch it at the Bellagio or one of the, one of the smaller galleries here in town, that's great, but you know, you can enjoy the murals from, from your car, from walking down the street with a slice of pizza in your hand. And it's my love letter to, to my hometown.